You remember this church? This church is where I was baptized. It, in, in 85, I think. Pastor Bob Dunbird. He did not like to be called Rev. It split in 80, late 80, September 88, and we left. Yep, here's the same old house. 14 years later. March 23rd, 2014. One last look, what might be your last. They've cut down the cherry, the cedar, and the fir tree that was grown together as one tree in front of the ditch. It's not here anymore. Not yet, you too will die. Chris. You remember this house, Chris? You remember it? Jasper lived here. In fact, back in 1983 and 84, the bus you drove rode home to you at Lee Deedee's house and dropped it off here. Now, just a abandoned house. All boarded up. Can you believe that shit? Look at this. This was the Spate House. Back in 1995, right there was a toilet with the words air cargo paint, spray painted on a board hanging over the top. And I believe we can go in this house. I believe I do believe we can go in this motherfucker. You see this shit? <gasps> you see this shit? Let's go inside this motherfucker. Goddamn motherfucker. Shit. God fuck it. You see this shit? <gasps> you see this shit? Talking about shit and piss. <laughs> Just. 
motherfucker. There's a shitter. In fact, I have to take a piss. And remember, you do not see my pecker in this fucking video, so before you flag this bitch, all you see is a fucking sweet stream of urine. God damn it. Chris, you're such a dead shot. God fucking damn it. Shit. <laughs> you see this shit? <gasps> you see this shit? You Chris, you Chris Chris, you bad boy. You remember. You and your cousin. And Boot. And that mischievous fucking neighborhood kid shooting bottle rockets at a fucking honeybee's nest in the attic of the house that once was there. So the smoke would disorient the bees so you can move in and kill them. You remember asking Casey, Casey, uh, want these bottle rockets burn the building down? And he's like, no, Chris. You remember what happened? This building fucking burned to the ground because of you and your hoodlum friends and your cousin. You were lucky. The owner didn't mind. That's what those two, the, to the two sheriff's deputies who came to interview you said. If you hear nothing from us, then everything's okay. You remember you and that same cousin, Casey, in those barns that w stood over there battling a nest of bumblebees. Better days, better days. You can't go back. God damn it. You see this shit? <gasps> you see this shit? Remember this house. Remember your three girlfriends. Stephanie, Peaches, and Danielle. Well, Peaches live here. Isn't it a coincidence that the house is peach colored. Those three girls on the bus, well, they were your friends. Jennifer Welch lived there. She was your girlfriend. You remember she wrote that you let love you letter saying I love and then signed her name, Jennifer. You remember Keith and Kim Moss lived there. You've been in that house. Remember that abandoned house of in the other those uh, overgrown remains. On now, take one final look at this house. For it may be your last. Oh, Chris, in 13 years you're gonna have a fucking stroke. Now who in the fuck left the goddamn abandoned motor boat behind the rot? Not, not, I, some people, I can't believe this fucking shit. Uzi spit Uzi? Spit him, spit him, spit him, spit him. Oh, love. If time had a definite start, but, has got his internal forwards and backwards from everlasting to everlasting he can go back before time and create other time streams other 
realities, which would give sense to the A causes B causes C causes A theorem. What type of bird is that? Uh, out here, it looks like a half cardinal, half 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 spare. Let me see. <laughs> I've never seen a bird like that before. When I went outside to walk for about 30 minutes, my head it virtually went away. But now that I'm back here sitting and relaxing, this damn head is back. What the what it what the fuck is this? Should I kill myself before this kills me with enough fucking stroke? The other day when I went to the store, someone saw me over there and said, Hey, there's Rage. <laughs> the other day when I went to the store, someone saw me over there and said, Hey, there's Rage. <laughs> the other day when I went to the store, someone saw me over there and said, Hey, there's Rage. <laughs>